Hey, so, last uh, video I posted, I had to split it into two parts, since uh, I accidentally recorded too much footage and couldn't edit it all together into, you know, a timely video, so I thought I'd split it in half, and you've already probably seen the, second, the first half. If you haven't seen the first half, go watch that. This will all probably make more sense. Uh, but without any further ado, I want to start off the second half right now. Um, I think I want to start working on the kitchen interior. So the kitchen is probably going to be one of the more important interiors because it's technically an exterior because it's like gonna it's supposed to be visible. Uh, let's grab some trapdoors. I already have a craft table here. Grab some trapdoors. Six is enough. And I want to make a little hallway right here. Hold on. Before we actually start doing interiors, I want to figure out where the ceiling's going. So I think I, this is probably going to need to be kind of open. But let's see. That almost seems a little high, though. Doesn't leave a ton of room for improv. Uh, eh, I think, yeah, that, that probably will work, though. So, let's actually get some oak planks. So I think that'd be kind of interesting. Sort of change it up a little bit. Or, um, oak logs. And let's do it this way. So, like that. And just do more. Let's bring that along. More. Let's bring that along. Last but not least. <laughs> More slabs. Okay, get rid of that weird bit, and then I think I also might want to grab. I have three should be enough. Some dark oak stairs, and let's sort of bridge that gap, or maybe make it spruce stairs, since this is already spruce. Yeah. There we go. All right, got our little roof going. Let's see. So I need to. Finish bringing that all the way up in a second. So, let's put it like that. Then we put one. I need to hop up here. Two. On top. There we go. It is a little bit tall, so I think I actually might just bring this roof down a bit. Let's just do the same oak and dark oak thing here. Um, upstairs, upstairs works. So maybe not here. But after that, yeah, that's fine. Then another upstairs. That works. That doesn't work. Does it work, actually? Kind of, actually. I do kind of like that. Let's just make all these stairs, because I'm probably not going to need for anything else. Even foreshadowing. Different, bring different wood types into here. I think we have to bring this up early. Which isn't too bad. It's fine. Um, we could get a oak door, an an oak door, not a oak door. I know my grandma. Uh, I need to grab some more oak logs. Half stack is probably more than I need, but we will grab it nonetheless. Let's. What we're doing? Oak door. But of course, this place is a bakery, so if we're making a kitchen, obviously they're gonna have some furnaces. I just knew. Also, a cauldron is like a sink if I have a tripwire hook. Which I do. Um, let's see. So, stove here. Trapdoors on the ends. Probably a sink right there. I need to grab a water bucket. That in there. Tripwire hook. That doesn't make sense. Wait, yeah, no. Cauldron. Faucets don't exist in medieval times. If they get water, they're gonna have a well. It's not gonna be a faucet. I'm brain dead! I do still wanna give them a sink, but they're not gonna have a faucet. It's just gonna be normal water. It's just like sitting there. <laughs> I've lost it thoroughly. Let's sleep real quick, it's pretty dark. I also want to have, a, like, a 
that sort of like pastry glass case with the food in it. Like, you know, they have like, like ice cream shops and stuff. So hold on, for like the cakes. Could do some stripped on stripped. This is way more expensive than I anticipated. Just sort of some stripage. That looks kind of nice. I like the idea of having the counter come along sort of inside a bit. Well as a fence gate coming on either of those sides. Alright. I do want the glass case to go back here. It's more of like a joke than actually a real detailing. I should probably get rid of this glass first because it's going to be tedious to put the stuff back here. Let's get three cakes. Put them on there. Put them back in the case. Need the cake. Alright, fine. I will get the cake forcefully. I will forcefully get the cake. Prepare for impact in three, two, one! Got the cake. <laughs> yes, it was unnecessary, but it was also funny. Or no, it kind of does. I don't know. It's not really supposed to look good. It's kind of, it's, it's still kind of uh, more like a joke. I'm sorry. I tried, Acacia. I t just so damn ugly. I'm sorry. Oak just looks miles better than a case. Yeah. It's so weird. I, I am, I'm gonna use it at some point. Just not now. It's so bad. If you can, like, work Acacia into a build and not have it be, like, an awkward mess like that was, props to you. Because I cannot do that. As you've seen, I've tried. Not there. Can't even play stairs, right? Probably gonna, um... We're baking pie and cakes. Those are probably just gonna go in here. They're gonna need this and, like, for to do, like, a rolling pin. Where they, like, roll the dough. Um... They're not making cookies. But they also need, like, a place to grind the bread, I'm pretty sure. Grind the wheat to make it into flour to make it into bread. I'm pretty sure. So... We need to give them a little spot to do that. Some stone brick should work. Just like one. Literally all we need. Play like that. That's fine. Um, and then do that. So it looks a bit more intentional. I think that's most of it. I have a really good idea. So you can silk touch cakes, correct. I need to double check that you can silk touch cakes. Because I don't want to accidentally destroy our, our world's first cake. <gasps> Can you not? Alright, well our first cake is kind of just stuck there. My <laughs> Okay, let me elaborate. My idea I had was we were going to put the cake in the cake case. Uh, like our first cake. And because it's like special, because it's the first cake we baked in our world. Um, I was going to put, like take this cake, put it in the case, and have a diamond block underneath it. But since, like, the way the since cake is like an entity, you can literally just barely see one pixel border around it. And I thought I was going to be funny. Like, I would waste an entire diamond block just for that accent. But now I'm realizing our, di our cake is just stuck. Um, let's, since we're almost done with this little kitchen interior, let's grab some lanterns. I know I have plenty. There we go. Since the roof is kind of high, I think we're allowed to use a chain to hang the lantern from. Works better if it's here. I do like the idea, however, of putting a lantern here. Come on, I'm getting through. Uh, I do like the idea of putting a lantern there. I don't know. I don't think we can get away with the chain. It's just a little too cumbersome. I do kind of think the chain works there, but when I put it here, it's just a bit cumbersome. Like, that's going to be annoying. You're probably going to bonk your head on. But they're not really doing much over here, so I think it does kind of work. However, instead of that, I think on the counter works better. And if it's on the counter, then I don't think we need one here. 
We'll have to check at night. Hey, bud. I don't know where my bow is, but I can still kill you. I hate every one of you. Shut up! Stay in the hole! You're not allowed out. You're grounded. Li you're grounded, literally. <laughs> okay, so I got the interior finished. Alright, so the interior finished up now. I also came in this hallway real quick. I just added a floor with some beams or some barrels. And then also I threw in some of these taller beams. Um, that sort of break up this kind of flat trapdoor sort of look and create a little bit of, you know, uh, coziness, almost claustrophobia as you walk through here. You know, it's pretty, it's still pretty compact, even though this house is nice and big, you know, it's still kind of small. Anyway, that's that. I've also added texture around the sides. Now, we can start to look at the upstairs. So, I don't actually know how I'm gonna do this. Hello. I'm gonna, like, get into the upstairs real quick. Probably not the smartest way, but I'm gonna get there regardless. Now. Oh, so this is still a little, like, a genuine amount of space that's here. I could come through here and just make that floor. Obviously, I need to fill this in real quick. I'm having a hard time figuring out where to put our um, staircase upstairs. So, I almost want it to be like here. But it doesn't work because obviously the wall is here. So, I could do a ladder right here maybe. Yeah, that could work. It's like a ladder, and I will have to fix this because these are. Oh yeah, it doesn't show up at all, so it's fine. Let's see. I'm gonna sleep real quick because there's some zombos out and about that I don't want to have to deal with. But I'm gonna sleep real quick and then get some ladders, and then we can start doing the upstairs, and then we can finish off this episode. You know, I probably already have ladders. Yep. Hmm. Actually. Yeah, I'm, I'm realizing though, I do think we're really out on um, spruce wood because I accidentally just made all of our logs into planks. I thought. Oh, no, I might. No, I, I might have some more in here. I just like misplaced. Uh, all right, I don't have any more. Um. We have not done a time lapse this episode, I guess. So, uh, good a time as any to get a time lapse going, I guess. Because there are some other woods. We need, like, spruce. Birch is fine. But we also need some oaks. We're kind of running low on that. Maybe, definitely need some dark oaks. Yeah. I'm going to hop into a time lapse mode and catch you guys on the other side. Actually, that's probably more than you need, but, you know, just going with it anyway. So, now, I got our little ladder installed. I can put that there. Oh, I had some ladders. There we are. Okay, so here is the room. I actually also need to grab the windows. Those are important. I can make this. I'm so gamer. Anyway. 
Let's grab some lanterns. Okay, so they've already got a kitchen and whatnot. They're probably gonna wanna have a couch where they can sit and read. Or something, I'm just gonna put that there for now. They grab some dark oak stairs. It's got like a semi couch thing going. They can sit and read next to their window, have some light coming through. Then, uh, let me get a spruce trap door. Just put on the end of that. And of course, I want to put some bookshelves along that. Along up here. I think I have some emeralds and I should be able to grab some. Four emeralds. That should be enough for s as many as I'm looking for, I think. Okay, wait, actually, I need to cure some of my villagers because a lot of them are zombies. And I need them to be. to not be zombies. Um. What do you need? Weakness potions? I. I better have some weakness potions. Poison. Uh. Weakness is. Fermented spider eye. So. One, two, three. Alright, let's grab these. Finally, I uncure these villagers. I've been trying. I've been meaning to do this for a very long time. I just. haven't. Let's cure you. Uh, there's another guy over here. Nope, not here. Here. And last but not least, there should be another one in here. <sighs> While they're doing that, I'm also gonna try to uh, like give them doors, but still block them. Because the zombies keep breaking down the doors and killing them. So I need to fix that, so it doesn't happen constantly. Let's give him a door, but lock it up. Give him a door, but lock it up. So I don't have to deal with that, because it's really annoying having to do that every single time. Here we go. Let's just wait for them to get cured in the meantime. We can start to focus on the bedroom details. So actually arguably the more important part of the bedroom is the bed itself, so let's actually grab that. Okay, so it's gonna be a similar situation with trapdoors being our main like wall ingredient thing. But this time I want to do it out of dark oak, because I think that'd look pretty there. No, 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 right here. Also, I think I might actually want to make these like this. Because that seems a bit more flush. Bed. I need to go here. Oh, hold on. Yeah, bed go here. And then I want to give him like an actual desk. Ooh, but I think one of the, the villagers we need for the bookshelves just fix itself. Nope. But it's really close, I think. Ah, there we go. Three for a I just cured you. You're so greedy. There we go. Got some emeralds. And hold on, what do you sell again? Oh, you're so touch. So that's gonna be important at a certain point. I think I heard the Fletcher guy just yep, we're fetching trades. Top over here. And by Two more bookshelves, I think. I think that's how much space there is. It's I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And my plan is to have stripped logs going this way, just like that, and then a backward stair right there to sort of create like a roof, because I don't want to have to make the roof like go all the way up to the top. I think that sort of checks out nicely. Ever, I do need to fix the outside roof because it's still kind of strange the way it's made. Because I had to do some weird sort of voodoo magic with slabs and stairs and stripped things. So let's bring our stripped logs across here. Get rid of the lantern. Out of the way, Kuli. Bring those back across. 
Strip those. There we go. Get another, uh, thing over there. And then, honestly, I'm thinking we could do a dark oak log like that, sort of holding that up. Put some trapdoors like that. And I think I want to keep this sort of bordering right here as spruce because this is already dark oak. We have this as well as dark oak, so I want to keep some color diversity. Alright, I think. Uh, I could go with a dark oak door. I don't see why not. Because they're very nice. I mean, these people are pretty rich, so they're going to have a nice door. Like a little golden door handle. Yeah. Get rid of this. Then, up here, we could do a stair like this. It'll sort of help with this being strange. As well as on that side. Then for the desk. I like the idea of doing a lectern. Open up this door. Let's get a lectern. Uh, pop down our crafting table real quick. Make some planks. Want to get some stairs with just enough for a uh, trapdoor. Thinking of putting the lectern maybe in the center of the desk, of the desk sort of. And then I could also have a chair. Uh, uh, Something nice, like dark oak, probably. Just because I want to make the chair out of something other than the same wood, so that it's sort of differentiated from that. Let's more like a chair. Let's get um, a sign. There we go. I don't, could do some dark oak. No, I think we should go with the spruce. I think. What? Where did that stair go? It just like vanished behind the lectern. That was interesting. I've never seen that happen. I think it's because the lectern's hitbox is really strange. There we go, and then get rid of this lantern for a second. Do the same on the other side. This lantern, just my offhand for now. Thinking we could do the stairs like that, so we'll sort of round it off, since I can't put a stand there because the trap door. Give the bed. A little bit of a nope. Uh, I'll have to get rid of this for a second. A bit of an end to it. Put this stair back and pop a lantern like on the side. Before we go, I want to get a bit of something going on on the side. Because right now it's really flat and I don't like it. I need to have like a little loading unloading station where they get their ingredients and whatnot and I think I want it to be right here so it's sort of off to the side um, like that I think that's kind of a cool sort of shape and then if we can grab some stone wall Instead of just like a normal fence, put this there, there. Um, I could just put a normal like slab like here. Get rid of that. Put that there. That works. And then I also need to get some uh, item frames for. Well, first of all, we need to have some cake on display. It's cake, pumpkin pie, and bread. Those are the things they're selling. There. I don't have any bread. Where did the bread? Oh, yeah, I'll put it in here somewhere. Got all these bits. Just sort of showing what they're selling. Like that. And I made one extra. Back here. Back here, they're also selling some bread. But that's sort of like an extra thing. Solely for the purpose of sort of filling that space. Because I was having a bit of trouble. Just like thinking about that. Um, we need some slabs. And planks. I don't have enough. Uh, we can probably replace this with a barrel, and then put a barrel or two up there, up there, there's their little bread stand. I don't know. I needed something that should sort of fill that space, as well as gave a reason for why the path sort of, like, meanders around that way. Okay, and now, finally... I think we are done 
with this house. Let's fly up and get a nice old view of it. You can't because my render distance is low, so I can run the shaders, but uh, you can imagine it's there. Now, uh, let's get a nice little view, starting to finally fill in that section of space up here, and filling in this space, making it seem sort of cramped and cuddled. But I think that is that for today's episode. If you liked the video, like the video, relatively straightforward. If you're new around these parts, then hit that big red button at the bottom right hand of your screen. Thank you all so much for watching. Let's see all next episode! Thanks for watching. Hey, welcome to the end of today's episode. Um, I am actually recording this right around when this video is going to be posted. I'm recording it while I'm editing. But, I wanted to let you guys know about a few things that are going on. So, first of all, I know last uh, upload, I believe it was supposed to be the hide and seek video that uh, broke, our movie kind of glitched out. It um, and, because of that, you know, I feel like I kind of had to at least let you guys know. Because I don't want to just go radio silent for a week. And, it's the same again, this time, I am... Oh, I should not be doing this at night. With that, nice surprise out of the way. I want to do this one off. Just wanted to let you know, though, that I am going to the beach for a week of vacation. It's going to be nice to sort of kick off the real start of summer. I'm going there for 4th of July, you know. It's going to be nice hanging out with family for the first time in a while. Uh, but anyway, I just wanted to let you know that I'm probably not going to be able to make a video that week just because I want to sort of relax and, you know, just, yeah, relax. But um, anyway, I think that's it for the end of today's episode. Not much else. Um, I will have to fix up this house in a second, right, right after I end off this one. But anyway, without any further ado, I'm going to end off this video. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all next Sunday, or earlier, if I'm streaming. Bye.